This video was recorded live on my Twitch channel. Check out all of my live streams down in the description below. Time for the final championship of the National Beast section of this game, GT Compact Series. A series of cars of 4.2 meters, 13.8 feet, or less in length, battle your way through all three races and earn a place on the podium. So back to a championship format, Autumn Ring Mini Reverse, Capering Inside, and Suzuka Circuit East. You think the licenses prepare you in an overkill manner? <laughs> I mean, bro, you have to get prepared to race, you know, little cars like this. So the little car that we'll be racing, extra thank you for the follow is the 2010 Mazda Demio Sport. All right, Ender, later, man. Have a good night in Deutschland. Ooh, that red looks really nice. Like that blue looks cool, but like, okay, no pun intended, but like that red looks pretty mint. Like, I'll, uh, green, no. We'll get into red. I really like this Demio. There's only one thing I'm going to do with it. So, if you guys remember the National B License Exam number 2. GC Auto Arrow. Oh, it might have. We'll go check it out. There's only one thing I'm going to do to the car. You'll see right now. If you guys remember in the exam, the car is an automatic. So, what we're going to do, NB1, yep. We're going to give it a 5 speed. That's it. We'll give it some character. So, a GT Arrow. Let's see here. What do we have? Uh, okay. I can be wingless. Yeah. Like, the generic wings are just... Gen oh my god, that's fucking awful special wings I mean it's not pretty but it's not the worst I've seen there's hardly any cars that have any other arrow stuff that we can do the only one I can really think of is um did you say 4,200 centimeters <laughs> it's all good dude I'm pretty like I'm pretty tired myself and I could knock out right now, but like instead I'm streaming because I haven't streamed in like a week and a half because of school and here I am. Making a fool out of myself on my twitch.com forward slash the T H E M O V I N G C H C H I C A N E. Um I guess those are compact cars. Uh, NCRX7 or R7, MX5, uh, uh, Mr. S, a CR a CRX, Starlet, and Sarah. All right, fair enough. Basically, they're all small boys, and I, I think of Compact as like super minis, like the Demio here. Like the reason why I chose this car in particular is because. There's somebody like that one of my friends is friends with or LC he LC's friends with some dude who Track days a Mazda 2 and it looks really goddamn cool So I was like, you know what this is a cool car. I like the Mazda 2. I like the Demio a lot Yes, thank you for the phonetic spelling Chris appreciate it Thank you very much So easily past the Starlight. The CRX, ooh, that's another semi-premium. That's right. Yo, that car looks sick. I was supposed to use the phonetics over the mic. Dude, I am not gonna say Tango Hotel Echo, Mike, Oscar, Victoria, India, November, Golf, Charlie Hotel, India, Charlie, Alpha, November, Echo, all at once, okay? That's too much work.
All right, how far ahead are they? We might need to buy sport hearts. 6.0 seconds. Can we cut six seconds in the lab? I don't think so, but we'll try anyways. Unless the game shows us mercy. Oh, the game's showing us mercy. You said the movie should gain letter by letter? Yeah, but see, one syllable versus I don't know how many for each word. Die bomb. Come on. Let's get the arc, uh, arc 7. MX5, damn it. Sorry. Sorry for the TGG strat, but we had to. Done. Shopping cart custom wing? 300SL has a... Really has a custom wing? Or like a special wing? Hmm. Unless it's just... Unless it's the, the uh, unless it's the generic one, that the generic five that you can select. All right, race number two. Time for Cape Ring inside. The better of the Cape Ring layouts, in my opinion, because fuck the north section, the south section are really nice. Top three red, bottom three gray. I didn't even notice. Yes, here's a lesson in life, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to win races, just buy a red car. Oh, wait. The red cars are not winning anything now because their cars fucking suck. That's the post he's going to come after me after this video comes out on YouTube. Or if they find this video on my Twitch. Alright, here we go. Race two. Three laps around Cape Ring. Just use blood. That was a terrible corner, but I was reading Chris's comment. Imagine showing up in the championship in a fucking Sarah. Dude, the Sarah's a cool car. Don't be hating on the Sarah. Dude, the Sarah's a nice looking thing. I can totally see I can totally see Test Drive buying a freaking Sarah. <laughs> Honestly. I'd buy a Sarah because the, the doors are adorable. Like dude, it's a cute little goal wing car. Like how can you hate on it? Look at it. As we drive away to in the distance away from the Sarah. Can we zoom past the Scarlet? Yes, after the biggest brake check ever. Yep. So we're basically playing catch up for lap two. 12.5 seconds. That was so heavy on the brakes. Don't Sarah shame me. Exactly. Don't, don't shame Sarah. Sarah the Sarah. Bro, it's not even runner branding. It's my total skill. Like, I'm a god. Can't you see clearly? That's why I finish, like, the bottom half of the field every time for top split races in GT Sport. Rubber Bandy's not working yet. Well, until I get into this chicane here, then we're going to cut down like five seconds. And in the final section of, of the track here. <laughs> five seconds. Oh, my God. Yeah, I, exactly. I beat Brazilian Death Sun, so I am a god. Look at that, see? In a demo around the outside of the MRS. Guys, come on. This is all skill here and totally not the AI giving me a chance to win because they feel sorry for me for choosing this underpowered car. 
any NC or um, RX7, God, stop calling it RX7. Any NC MX5 fans in the house? That's a card that I really didn't like too much until recently. Like a triple apex, yeah, it's a weird section of corners. This would make for a fun lobby race, though. Like, like, like maybe like spec super mini cars like this around here. That'd be a grand old time, in my opinion. Anyways, race number two done. Once again, red sweeps the podium, and silver pretty much sweeps the bottom half of the field. Oh yeah, I for. I, didn't, I never thought about it like that, Chris. That's true. So anyways, the championship is pretty much le more or less won. All we gotta do is pretty much just finish, like, third and we'll be okay. But, um... Yeah. <laughs> Istanbul Park. Suzuka Circuit East is the finale. For this series. Now the question is, is this going to be a hard finale? No. No, it's going to be really goddamn easy. Oh, the male's here. I can tell because I can hear my dog barking in the background. She's such a cutie. The classic Everybody Drips Here track. I was watching uh, Chevette. Well, not watching him like live or nothing. He posted on Twitter like a couple months ago of him drifting and iRacing the freaking super late models around here. And I was like, dude, that's so damn cool. He said that's like the only car that you can really drift in iRacing. Almost had Satan number. The eight in the middle had to ruin it. Well, at least I can tell, like, this core is pretty well suited for the S's, so the rubber banding doesn't really help us too much. It's going to be towards the end where the AI just starts slowing down on the straightaway because they feel sorry for us. That was a horrible turn one and two. Because of the LM. I don't blame you. I'm a fan of the Del Sol in general because the Del Sol looks awesome. They work on your race car? I've never played Prologue. So I thank you for ruining that, Chris. I didn't know that. No, I'm kidding. I that's like something so mundane that it doesn't really matter. But that's pretty funny regardless. Well you do need to check shit out. Like for yeah, check and make sure the car's in working order. Uh you gotta make sure it has windshield fluid. I don't know. What else can you check? Oh, I gave him the bonk. Damn, he was slow. I don't want to bonk him. Try not to bonk the AI too much. Even if they're dumb and they deserve it sometimes. Yeah, exactly. Checking to see if all the bumper magnets are there, bro. That's that's a hard job, Chris. Are are you trying to tell me that you know 
that the that the people who check out bumper magnets on a Ford Focus that their job is meaningless. How dare you? Yep, track day complete for drifting. We drifted a Mazda 2 around here. We did some sick skids, yo. Alright, well, that's the GT Compact Car Championship complete. Complete sweep of the championship. Championship was really freaking easy, in all honesty. First place trophy, and we get 20,000 credits. Back up to 10 million, because the Hudson costed a lot of money. The Hudson was expensive. But worth it, because it was a cool car to drive. And now we've got all the stars, which means... Price car, we get the Acura NSX. Speaking of pop-up headlights, that looks so nice. You and Judica? Dude, I... D I... Okay, here's the thing. Fuck. That reminds me, I'm supposed to review the start of the... Fuck, God damn it. Um, Thank you for reminding me. Dude, I was so caught up with like with some of my quizzes this morning for school and getting some work done that like when I finally got all my shit done, I literally was just like, man, I'm good. Like I'm so like I'm really I'm ready to just relax and just chill and have a good time. And I completely forgot about checking out the race. Didn't Judica win Tokyo? I thought I overheard that he won Tokyo. Nice little arrow kit. Does it? We'll have to check it out. Oh, it might have because of the um, LM race card that it, that it has here. So 18% of the way down with the game now. And watch replay. I will. And that's it for all the regular B license events. There's one more thing that we have to do. And we'll get to it soon. <laughs>